Do you know what these items have in common? A plastic spoon, plastic cup, plastic bag, plastic bottle, and a bag of chips. These are the top five plastic items found by divers in our oceans. We are currently facing a once in a generation opportunity to put in place a legally binding instrument that could end the marine debris crisis for good. In 2022, the United Nations approved a landmark agreement to create the world's first ever plastic pollution treaty. Divers have already been sounding the alarm on the marine debris crisis for decades. We know that 70% of marine debris is comprised of plastic items. We know this because millions of passionate paddy divers around the world have been building a wave of evidence by reporting marine debris into our flagship citizen science program, Dive Against Debris. This program monitors plastic pollution over time without damaging the marine environment. Impact stories are coming in from coastal communities around the world. We have all seen the devastating effects, either from the news, firsthand, or from friends. We know that marine animals are being entangled. We see littered coral reefs covered in trash. We need a strong plastic treaty now. So what does that mean? Number one, we turn off the tap. With over 14 million tons of plastic entering the ocean every year, we have to stop plastic at its source. Number two, prioritize marine debris items. The items that are most commonly found as entering the marine environment need to be made a priority as items to avoid. Number three, make it trackable. We wanna work alongside governments after the treaty is ratified to ensure that we can measure impact over time. So how can you get involved? We're calling on you, our global community around the world, to join us by one, signing the petition. This ensures that Patty Aware Foundation can negotiate from a position of strength at the international table. Another way you can take action is just participating in a Dive Against Debris event, whether you're a diver or not. This ensures that we have real-time data to inform policymakers on what's beneath the waves. We hope you'll join us to be a voice for the ocean and turn off the tap for good.